It's called Imaginatron by Moonbot Interactive. So this app works with this book right here. Okay. And real quick, because I know you guys are excited, I'm going to show you. I'm using my camera. So there's Mr. Joseph recording us. And here you guys go ahead and just wave because everybody wants to do it. <laughs> All right, now stop waving. That's going to be the last time you wave until now, we're done with the book. We're going to use our augmented reality app. And look at this book. Oh. It has come to life. Do you see it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Now follow along as I read this book, okay? The Fantastic Flying Books oh, by Mr. Yeah. Morris Westmore. Okay? What kind of storm do you think this is, friends? Tornado! So a tornado comes through. The winds blew and blew till everything that Morris knew was scattered, even the words of his book. Wow. Now these words are describing how he feels. What do you think he's feeling? Mm -hmm. I'm happy, sad, blue, blue, crummy. Let's crummy. see what happens next. The book led him to an extraordinary building where many books apparently nested. And where do you think he's going, guys? Library. Is it just any library? It's a magical library. The flying books. <coughs> Morris? Sometimes Morris will become lost in a book. Wow! He's he's so so and he's scarcely fine. emerge for days. He's he's fine. Fine. And fall down. <laughs> Look at that giant book. Everybody around him is sleeping. Do you see those Z's? Yeah, just wow. They're going in circles. Chair, <laughs> As he wrote, the days passed. So did the months. And then years. What season are we in right there, friends? Fall. So far. Even more years pass. We're what, now winter, in winter. winter. We see some snow falling from the sky. Yeah. Now his old friends took care of him the way that he had once taken care of them. And they read themselves to him each night. Hmm. Hmm. Touch. Yeah. Oh, wow. Touch. The books were sorry, but they understood. Morris put on his hat and took his cane. As he went to the door, he turned and smiled and then waved goodbye. I'll carry you all in here, he said, and pointed to his heart. Whoa. The books circled around Morris to say goodbye. As he passes. He's going around us. The books waved their pages and Morris Lesmore flew away. And as he flew, he changed back to the way that he'd been that long ago day when they had first met with the opening of a book. No. There we see her reading just like Morris did. And the story goes on. And that is Mr. Morris Lassmore. You guys can now wave goodbye to him. Goodbye. The end. Yes? No. no? Did you like you love you didn't just like it, you loved it? Yeah. That's awesome. Did you feel like you were really there? Yes. So as we were talking, this is called augmented reality. It took this room and changed it a little bit. It's called augmenting. It augmented the room a little bit. This is our reality, the library. And this book and this app added something extra. It changed it just a little bit. We have more books to read like this, guys. And what I want you to take away from this book is that Mr. Morris Lesmore found his happiness in that library and in different books. And he said that he read many different adventures. You can live many different lives just by reading a book. 
And so when we start Read to Ride and start reading different genres, I want you guys to start to think about the different kinds of books that you will begin to like, okay? All right. You are so awesome. Give yourselves a pat on the back. You did such a good job. You guys rock. Are you ready to check out some books? Yes. Yes. Okay, we 